The Democratic National Convention in the United States of America, former U.S. President Barack Obama has endorsed Kamala Harris as the next president of the U.S. Obama told fellow Democrats that the U.S. is ready for Harris to be their president. He is called the Republican presidential candidate Donald Trump as dangerous and the torch has been passed to someone who will fight for Americans. Let's listen in to what Barack Obama said earlier. The next president, because we have a chance to elect someone who has spent her entire life trying to give people the same chances America gave her. Someone who sees you and hears you and will get up every single day and fight for you. The next president of the United States of America, Kamala Harris. It's been 16 years since I had the honor of accepting this party's nomination for president. And I know that's hard to believe because I have not aged a bit. <laughs> but it's true. And, and looking back, I can say without question that my first big decision as your nominee turned out to be one of my best. And that was asking Joe Biden to serve by my side as vice president. Because we... All right. Uh, these, of course, are the latest developments uh, coming in. Former U.S. President Barack Obama there uh, uh, endorsing Kamala Harris at the Democratic National Convention. Barack Obama showered praise on Kamala Harris at the uh, Democratic National Convention. Meanwhile, Barack Obama called the Republican presidential candidate Donald Trump dangerous. Sanjeev Srivastav, international affairs expert, uh, is joining us uh, for more details on this story. Sanjeev, uh, uh, clearly, of course, uh, big endorsement for Kamala Harris coming in for Barack Obama while he was speaking at the Democratic National Convention. Yes, certainly. This is a, a very big endorsement. And uh, Barack Obama, the former U.S. president, is still a very influential uh, leader in the United States of America. In the Democratic Party in particular, he has... Uh, uh, enormous uh, respect and uh, influence. And uh, when he has uh, endorsed um, Kamala Harris, then obviously she has got uh, a very big support. And uh, the kind of uh, speech he has delivered, and I remember when he was contesting and uh, he was uh, uh, was on a campaign trail during his uh, presidential campaign time, uh, the slogan was, uh, yes, we can. Now uh, he has raised this uh, slogan, yes, she can. So I think this kind of, uh, you know, slogans and uh, this kind of uh, very encouraging words uh, from a very influential leader uh, is a, a very big support uh, which uh, Kamala Harris has got. And it will certainly uh, unite uh, and, uh, and, uh, and uh, bring about uh, uh, solidarity among the uh, Democratic Party voters. And uh, also Barack Obama has uh, uh, some influence uh, in the undecided voters in Swing State in particular. Uh, uh, there, his support and his uh, endorsement uh, will make uh, 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 enormous uh, difference. And, I, and uh, you know that um, in the U.S. Uh, presidential elections, the swing states and undecided voters, they play the most important role. So I think uh, this uh, Democratic uh, National Convention and the kind of endorsements he has got uh, from Barack Obama and other leaders, obviously Hillary Clinton, Bill Clinton, and several other top uh, Democratic leaders, they have all uh, come together uh, to uh, take on uh, Donald Trump, the Republican Party nominee. So uh, this uh, is uh, going to be a very, uh, uh, very, very intensely fought elections today. And uh, I think uh, there are a lot of issues on which uh, the both the uh, you know uh, leaders uh, Kamala Harris and Donald Trump are going to be facing each other in the upcoming uh, presidential debate. And we are going to see a very, very interesting and intense uh, debate on several issues with the United States of America is facing. But yes, at this point of time, uh, Kamala Harris is uh, going to be uh, a Democratic Party nominee, and uh, she has got enormous uh, support and solidarity from the top leadership 
uh, of the Democratic Party, including uh, former U.S. President Barack Obama. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.